we are do i pull up yeah yeah i don't there's not an order thing here i mean no one's taking our order was it supposed to be back there no we're going out shopping december 26th um we're gonna stop at swig it's our thing now and we'll show you our drinks then I want to go to Hobby Lobby. I want to see if I can score any ornaments. <laughs> I don't know. I forget what's on sale this week, but if wall decor is on sale, I might look at some things for the dining room. I got my, the, the buffet sideboard got delivered this morning. So I feel like I might need a couple little things and then I can get the room finished and get it up for you guys maybe tomorrow as tomorrow's video but I also want to go to home goods because you know I'm not gonna lie I'm I'm wanting to see what they've got for Valentine's Day mugs I did already start cleaning out like Christmas but my goal is to just do one room a day and I think that's a really great way for me to pack away Christmas this year because then I'm not so overwhelmed to do it all in one day but then also it's like a soft transition from like Christmas to not Christmas so today's room was the kitchen. I felt like the kitchen we definitely needed to do just because we're in there a lot. And so I packed away all the kitchen. I vlogged it by the way. If you don't follow my vlog channel, it's linked down below. And so I started packing away Christmas and I was looking at my mugs. I'm gonna do a transition mug video for you guys like I did for Halloween to Christmas on this channel. If you wanna watch that, I'll link it down below. But the next video is gonna be transitioning from Christmas mugs to Valentine's Day mugs. So long explanation to tell you guys I also want to go to home goods I want to get the car washed and we're gonna pop into Target I def yeah Target I think has Valentine's Day stuff out too they do I saw it when I was there yeah okay good. getting your wrapping all right here's the shark attack you guys didn't see the gummy last time but this is how they deliver it which is so cute and Micah what'd you get not the sleigh all day but instead of the strawberry puree I just added like a fresh orange Oh, oh, the strawberry puree so sounds good, though. So there's lemon, fresh lemon and orange in there, and then it's like fresca, lemonade, peach, pomegranate. So cute. We need to take a picture because our drinks look so good together. Okay, here's our first stop. Our second stop is going to be there. But first we're going to go in here. I don't know how much we're going to find, but I want to see if I can get some ornaments. what I wanted to get and I scored plus it's 66% off so I got the little cardinal a lobster avocado a shark whale blue whale somebody seahorse a dolphin or you could just glue it okay now I'm just kind of looking oh my god We're getting that. That's going in the living room. Okay, look at what I found for the living room. Uh, wait, I already showed y'all. I just, I'm, sh I just love it. That's really cute too. I love like fire bed. I love stuff like this, like, like open country. Mm. The barn and the cows are doing it for me. I can't. I will never like, have look how cute else. that is. I don't have any cows yet either, but that is really cute. That's really cute. I really like that. I feel like I'm doing a mix of like vintage and farmhouse, but you know what? I'm just gonna do it. Why do you look like that? <laughs> We're gonna get these for the dining room, but they could be a return. I'm not sure, but I like how vintage they look. And I like that they're black. Oh, and you'll see why. Candles for them. I know, I do. 
our next door home goods. Okay, they're playing copyrighted music really loud, but I'm gonna do a haul in the car, but I'm I'm hitting a jackpot. Stop playing my vibe. Oh my god, that chair. Yeah. But I can't wait for that. I day. think decorating like is also a like one of the times, right? Okay. We did all Valentine's Day basically, but Micah did get a super cute pillow for her bed. Alright, so we made it back home and thought I'd give you guys a haul. Um, did I mention that I was I think I did. I've been clearing stuff out. I worked on my kitchen today. Um, so anyways, I don't, even, I don't even know where I'm going with that. Micah bought some candles. She likes burning, like the real, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. I like the ambiance. She likes the ambiance. Um, and then you're gonna see, you're, you're getting a little snippet of the dining room back there. But I did something very similar to the artwork that I DIY'd for my office. And I did something similar to that in the dining room. So, but the sideboard that I ordered is a very big piece. And I was thinking that maybe I could frame this big canvas artwork with this. I also like how vintage it looks. Like this looks very like rusted and old. So I thought that it would actually pair very well in there. I don't know if I'm gonna end up liking it. We'll see. This could be a return. Honestly, I don't know. I love this thing. I might have to like find somewhere else to use this. But this was $33.99, but it was 50% off. So I got two of those so that I could, you know, put them on either side. So we got that. And then the biggest goal at Hobby Lobby was to get some new ornaments. There are several different ways I want to decorate next year. And one way is with these like blown glass. I really don't know what these ornaments are called. If you know, please let me know. Also comment and let me know where else I can find stuff like this. Cause I don't want them all to just like come from Hobby Lobby. Um, I wanted to just kind of get some now because I knew being after Christmas that Hobby Lobby was gonna have a major sale. So I really want to just kind of like get a kickstart and I figured a sale is probably the best way to do it. So 66% off Christmas right now. So $7.99, but 66% off of that. These ornaments ended up being a range from two, three, and four dollars. So considering how you know expensive they are, I thought that was a steal. The crab is super cute. So I got him. Actually, I need to wrap them back as I go because Christmas is over. But I want a tree fully dedicated to just these ornaments. It might be the, the dining room tree next year. Okay, then I think you guys saw most of them actually, but just so you can kind of see them in detail, here is the rooster. He was $12.99, so he was one of the ones that was like $4. I want them to be very random. I don't want there to be any sort of theme to these ornaments. I would like for them after this, after this, I would like for them to start having some type of meaning, but also I'm okay with them being random too. Like it doesn't really need to all be, this one I'm very worried about. Comment also let me know how I can store these. I don't know, is there something that you use from like Amazon specifically for these? Because like his little thing, was this a narwhal? Nar is that how you say it? Narwhal? Mm -hmm. Um, I feel like I don't know how to properly store these ornaments. Okay, next up we have the avocado. Now this one has meaning just because Micah loves avocados. So whenever I see those, I definitely always think of her. So super cute. Um, but yeah, there doesn't need to be any kind of theme. It could be a mix of aquatic and just random. But I have to say this, this set from Hobby Lobby this year with the, these are just absolutely stunning. Like I just don't even, God, can you imagine like designing ornaments? That's got to be so fun. So 
the turtle was really pretty. Now, I don't know if you, you don't know this, but the dolphin ended up breaking. <laughs> so we did not, we did not go home with the dolphin, but we did get someone else. I'll show you who we got. Then we have this gorgeous octopus. Wow. Stunning. Took two bags to put these in. Um, and then here is the one Micah likes. She likes the, what are these called? Whale sharks. Whale sharks. She really likes them. I mean, this, there's pearls and rhinestones and like $11.99, but 66% off. I was inspired by a TikTok that I saw. If, if I'm able to download and share it, I'll insert it here. But this is basically what triggered this. I was just like, yeah. Yeah. And you know what's funny is I've always loved these ornaments. Always. But, and I have some of them on my tree now, but they're like Micah's ornaments. So I think actually we'll end up moving them. I'll end up using those and moving them to that tree. But I remember thinking, well, it's not really how I'm doing this tree. So I stayed away from them. But every year that I've gone into to Hobby Lobby, I've just been like, oh, I love it. Never once did I think, why don't I just do a tree full of these ornaments? I've always wanted a reason, but for whatever reason, I never found that reason. Does that make sense? Anyways, here's a cardinal. Cardinals are very special to me. So I'm also a cardinal sign. So there's that. Um, then we got the mushroom. The mushroom, I also think of Micah. She likes that stuff. It looks like it's like been dug out of the ground, which is really cute. Got that one. And then, I mean, I scored big time. I was really hoping I was gonna find more colorful ones like this, like the rooster one. I love the hot air balloon. I really want a lot of like different colors going on. Um, and then we got the little seahorse. Look at this side. He's kind of plain on one side, but like, look at that side. Stunning. He is just, I just, I don't even know. I don't even understand. We're not done. There's three more to go. So then we have this one. I love the manta ray. Like, look at that. What in the world? We got that. And then we have <laughs> this one definitely reminds me of Micah. It's just absolute perfection. It's kind of like, you know what I'm going to do too? I'm going to spend some time hot gluing this down because I don't know why it needs to be like loose anyways. So I'm going to hot glue those down. Um, and then this one, just because it kind of like reminds me of her Nintendo Switch that we just got. And I thought it was really cute and bright and colorful. So, and those are the ornaments. I definitely feel like I scored. Um, there were several more I could have picked up. There were some like bumblebee ones. I should have. I'm going to go back to Hobby Lobby. Maybe when it's a little bit calmer. We'll see if there's any left. A lot of them were actually broken. There was several I wanted to bring home. There was like a star. You guys know I love stars. And the last thing from Hobby Lobby was this massive picture with the black barn and the right colors. Like this is going to look so beautiful above the fireplace, especially because the fireplace mantle is so large. It doesn't look like it right now, but that picture, that frame that I have up is a poster size. That is a 24 by 36 and it looks tiny up there. So anyways, I think this, this is gonna look stunning. And now that you guys know I'm like decorating with black more, I think this is a perfect piece to kind of tie a lot of the black in together. I love stuff where it just, it look, it's outside. It just looks like a breath of fresh air. And the other thing, I love the wood frame. So at Home Goods, it's all Valentine's Day. So this is a Valentine's Day haul, basically. Um, I knew I wanted to just kind of check out their mugs and I also got some decor. 
So I got several pillows. Um, I think this is the direction I'm gonna go in, especially now that I'm decorating with black. I thought that I would do something like this for my living room. You never know with me, I can tend to change my mind the last minute, especially when I get all my decor out. And just sometimes things start changing. So I got that pillow. I got this one. They all go together. Um, this was $12.99. Let me see. $12.99. Pretty sure. Yeah, $12.99. It really started when we saw this one. So I like the neutral with the black hearts. And Micah got a pillow for her room. So cute. That is so cute. So I've decorated for every holiday now. I mean, I haven't like decorated, decorated. But yeah. Oh, I that's your Valentine's Day. Hmm? It's not every day. I thought we will, but it's oh. like you know, our Valentine's Day. Oh. Then I found this garland. I decided to get two of them. Now, fun fact about me, but I would actually prefer to decorate in a light pink or a hot pink, but every year it turns out to be red every year. So I was like, just keep going with the red. Plus I think the red's actually gonna look nicer with everything else I have going on. So I went ahead and picked up this garland, um, $14.99. I got two just because my fireplace mantle is pretty big. And I thought if I only end up using one, then maybe I'll use the other one like there or an entryway, I don't really know. So I got those, then I found these. I believe, no, at first I thought this was garland. <laughs> at first I, I, that's what I thought, $14.99, but I think they're actually like individual little ornaments, but I can definitely turn them into garland. So I got it in this like neutral color, raw color, and then the red. Um, and I figured I could either actually hang them off of like, a greenery garland kind of like I do with the ornaments but switch it out and do it with the hearts I think that would be really cute for the fireplace mantle and there's so many in here that I'm going to try to replicate the same garland in the fireplace mantle and I'll do the same in the entryway here are the rest of the pillows so love you to the moon and back super cute um it's got stripes on the back like this is this is what we're going for And then I got two of the hearts just because they were available and they're actually my favorite. And I was thinking, you know, I like to even things out. So maybe these two hearts will go on the big armchairs and the other three, I don't know, I'll style it somehow in the big couch. Um, and here's the third one. The third one is just one big heart. So just to show you. Like, how cute is that? Get them, get them all in the frame. So that's what hopefully I'm gonna commit to. And now my favorite part, the mugs. Um, I am gonna be doing a transition from, just to show you guys, a transition from the Christmas to the um, Valentine's Day. So if you're interested in that, subscribe if you're not already subscribed and then hit the bell and YouTube will notify you when I po post my videos. Um, hopefully I'll have that video out soon. I really wanna get more ahead of the game on my holidays this year because I really was so behind, but again, it was just, everything was crazy. We moved in September. <sighs> if you're new to my channel, um, I have a thing for mugs, but I am gonna go back through my mugs once I get Christmas rotated out and I'm going to try to like hit some type of goal where I just donate a certain number or I just get rid of and donate as many as I can. And just, you know, that's why, that way I'm not accumulating too, too much. Um, but anyways, I digress. So here's a new one. Ooh la la, that is so cute. Love how French it is. It is Ray Dunn, by the way. So interesting to see that she has a cursive font. Like what? $5.99, stunning. And then this one I love so much. Let me show you why. I have this in a Halloween version. Whoever this brand is, Lang, 
I love whoever that is. I love them. And let me just find, I'm gonna turn the camera so you can come with me. But like, they have it, they make one in Christmas. So like, these are all length. Like, do, do you see it? Do you see the, the designer? In this but let me also just like while we're here let me just show you my Halloween one as well Halloween got moved to this cabinet oh where is it oh it's way at the top let me grab the camera that one right there is laying and I think I have another one in there that's laying as well so as soon as I saw this I was like yeah it, it makes total sense. I don't know what it is about this designer. I just really like it. Then I found this one. What? $4.99. So freaking cute. Um, then I found this one at checkout, Obsessed. It's like daisies, but with the little heart in the center, $5.99. And it's laying. I, I just realized that, wow, love. And then Micah got one, look, look, remember? Oh yeah, I love Winnie the Pooh. I just love Winnie the Pooh, I don't know. I didn't know, I didn't even know that. I love Winnie the Pooh. That was your first Halloween costume. That was Pooh's jar of honey. It, like, come on, you see like 100 Acre of Wood and just all of them. The lining is so cute. It's just so cute. We were talking about this, like when she moves into her own apartment, it would be so fun for her to have like one little mini dinner dinnerware set that's like cutesy. 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 It could be like, you know, it could be like Winnie the Pooh or something or something thrifted. I have another um, Valentine's Day mug actually. Let me show you guys. I bought it like two weeks ago, I think. Yeah. Oh, here it is. I think I showed it in a haul, but like since we're doing mugs. And this was at Home Goods today. That's, that's so what cute. I know. That's why it like reminded me to show you guys. Love this one. It like looks like this one. Yeah, these are my favorites. I'm more where I don't like too much going on in some of my mugs. I like the more plain ones. I mean, like as far as I don't know how to describe my style because I do have some that like I've made myself on Etsy. In case you want to know about that, like I love my vintage mugs because they're so cute. Um, I'll just grab a couple of them, but they're all up on my Etsy shop. Like, I love these. Like, super cute. My little Valentine's Day ones. They're, I have so many more, by the way. I think they're up on my Etsy shop still. But anyways, these are all going to get rotated in there for Valentine's Day. <laughs> anyways, I don't even know how many times Mike has gone by in this video. It kind of reminds me of Loxie. I'm trying to clean. <laughs> my mess. Um, anyways, that's it. That's the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I do have what I got for Christmas coming up. I post that video every single year. So if you need a Christmas haul, that's coming. Um, I don't know what, which is going to come first at this point, honestly. It just kind of depends on the dining room and how quick I can get it together. But the dining room will either be tomorrow or Thursday. And what I got for Christmas will be one or the other as well. Just really kind of depends on how quick I can do the dining room. But anyways, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.